Hi, I'm Dr. Scott Fleck. I'm an interventional radiologist here at Washington Regional. Interventional radiology is a medical specialty that uses X-ray, CT, and ultrasound to do procedures minimally invasive inside the body. This allows us to diagnose and treat multiple medical conditions and allows us to do these procedures with a short recovery time. During an interventional radiology procedure, we often access a blood vessel and place a sheath such as this, and then through the sheath, a catheter and wire is then used. We use x-ray and ultrasound as well as CT to see our wire and catheter inside the body. So depending on the procedure, there are various access points that we use, including the groin, the neck, and various locations throughout the body to be able to get to the regions that we need to get to, all done through a very small incision. Interventional radiology procedures are done for many reasons. Some common reasons are to deliver radiation or chemotherapy directly to tumors, to collect a tissue sample to be examined for cancer, to stop internal bleeding, to treat liver disease, to dissolve or remove blood clots, to create something called a fistula, which creates wider, stronger veins for patients who are on dialysis, to treat uterine fibroids, avoiding the need for a hysterectomy. We also place stents like this to open blocked or narrowed blood vessels or ducts, and place devices such as chemo ports to allow easier access for medications to be delivered or blood to be drawn. So interventional radiology procedures are beneficial to patients as they are very minimally invasive. There are small incisions. They are typically performed using local anesthesia and moderate sedation. This allows our patients to typically be done as an outpatient, go home the same day and have a very short recovery period. To learn more about interventional radiology services at Washington Regional, visit wregional.com IR.